All right. Up next is game number 36, Game & Watch Oil Panic. I'm going to go ahead and start the timer. Ching. Um, yeah, so this is Oil Panic. It is the first in the uh, multi-screen series, which looks a lot like a DS. <laughs> they, they were doing dual screens all the way back then. Um, hopefully it's not too tiny for you guys. Would you prefer if I did... This, or is that just too ugly? Let's see. Just so that you guys can see it a little better. Maybe this is better. What do you guys think? And what benefit do you guys get to seeing the whole thing? You saw it already at the beginning. Well, unless you have any objections, I think I'll do it this way. We got left, right, aim mode, game mode A, game mode B. Take a look at the clock. So basically, I'm dumping oil. I have to fill the bucket with oil and then dump it to the guy with the barrel based on where he's at down on the down bottom screen. And if I miss, I dump it on the people. But yes, Dr. Bop, you're correct. This is indeed Game & Watch is down and being Smash Bros. Also, that part of the stage is actually, or that bottom half is a, a part of the flat zone stage, too. All right. Start with game mode one. Game A. And I, you don't have to fill it up all the way, but I think you get more points for doing it all the way. There's four. But it's, like, kind of risky to fill it up the whole way. Oh, shoot. Twice. Oh! Dang it, I didn't think about the fact that I could go further than that, and I just tried to mash to the wall. So that was four points. Just one. One! Okay, this is already hard to have to keep track of both screens. Oh my goodness. Part of me wishes so much distance from him, but I guess it's more accurate to the actual. Just a lot of that's a lot of empty space between the two screens. Oh, I was full. Gosh darn it. Well, I'm off to a great beginning. Is there is it landing onto like hot stoves and stuff? All right, let's try again. I may have to focus a little harder for this one. Yeah, I think at the start, I definitely want to just take advantage of the fact that I can fill it up three pretty easily. Because I imagine it'll be a little bit too much later on. How long does he stay down there for? That's what I'm scared. I'm going to go out there and I'm going to dump and he's going to not be there. That being said, I am getting points pretty quickly, so hopefully getting to 200 won't be too bad on this one. <laughs> oh, no. No, I went too far, man. It's hard sometimes when the guy's filling it up to, like, know when I'm going to activate again. Bummer. Maybe I should start focusing on two already. You know, for all the stuff they did in Ultimate, to make the Game & Watches look more like the characters, why doesn't he have this cap on when he pulls out the bucket? Uh-oh, this is bad. Oh! Why did that, like, mess up right before I went to it? I still got it. Really? Is, if two is only two, then it's not that much better than one. Like, one to one is just as good as two to two, right? That three-pointer. That actually is giving me a bonus. Why is there... Oh. Well, I was first off going to wonder why there was so much oil, but I guess we were taking the gas station. It still doesn't seem like the... 
Something doesn't seem uh safe about this situation. We're not following some sort of proper uh code. At some point, I want to try dunking it on the people <laughs> if I don't do it on, if I don't see it on accident, just because I want to see it. You know, I'm kind of surprised. I don't think they did any of the multi screens on the DSI re releases because that would actually make a lot of sense. Yes. Fine. I wonder if game mode B is just something like they can drip two at once. Because if you notice right now, it's always one drip at a time. The Game & Watch Gallery version of this one was weird. You're like, well, I guess we'll see it eventually. Oh. It's like not thinking about if it was safe to dump the bucket, but I just had to. You're like Yoshi eating the oil or something and spitting it out. Hurry up. I'm actually doing good. Just had to take me a second to like wrap my head around what I needed to do. Bad. Oh, not too bad actually. Too much. Uh oh, I didn't refill my life. That's a bad sign. What did they change for? No, I just dunked it on the lady. Hey! Dunked oil on me. Oh, you have a separate miss counter down there. So if I'm about to fail at the top and my only option is to dunk down there, I go for it. You mind looking up if there's a... Point where you gain life's back? Or if this is just nasty now. You know, I'm almost tempted to do what I was doing for DS games before and cut out the screen so that I can enlarge them even bigger for you guys. Oh. it up all the way uh this is a little sketchy hurry up oh ah! some reason i didn't realize i was full ah. oh 300 now okay Well, I guess my goal is even higher now. Great. This one turned out to be not too bad, though. Or at least not in this game mode. We'll see how hard and much harder the game mode is. Uh. Maybe they figured since you had twice as much life, sort of, not really, but... Oh, this is bad. Oh. Oh. 
I didn't realize it was full till I was looking right at it. At least on this mode, maybe it'll be harder in B. It seems like it's, it's always doable to just dunk it. Three. How high can I get? Bad. Oh, I moved too far. That's what's got me almost every time, is me moving too far. I'm mashing too hard to get out of the window. Or the doorways. Wait. Why are they like doorways that open up to a balcony? Like, like that one on the left looks like a garage door. Like something you're supposed to drive cars into. Then again, there's like kitchen stuff here. Yeah, this. Or maybe it's supposed to be like one of those gate doors you see. Commercial areas. Still doesn't explain why it's this high up. Yeah. What? I'm still dumping. Or maybe I wasn't. Maybe I should have mashed more. Okay, remember, it's at this point, it's better to fail your dunks. And, uh... Than to let the oil drip. I think they've gotten a little more elaborate with the points over time. I think of this one and the turtle one. It is interesting thinking. Like, this game is definitely them thinking in two screens and making a game around it. We're doing it this early. Uh oh, dump, dump, dump. Oh, I still got it. No, I went too far. Well, that is game mode A. When you guys say something, I'm actually slightly worried my chat's frozen. I asked a question earlier. Chat is not frozen. Okay. <laughs> I just thought Suji was going to look up the thing for me, but I guess not. Oh, um, next we will do game mode B. Okay, how much harder is it? Uh, cursor? Hello? I don't see a difference yet. The chat and stream actually isn't in the same order as yours. Interesting. Oh, you chose not to say anything. I got it. You missed it. Little Mario. <laughs> that still cracks me up. I was... Looking at that again a second ago because I was editing the. But ah, we're dumping because I'm more often fail there than. I feel like I fail the top more often than the bottom. I didn't even see his response. I forgot to look, actually look at him while I was dunking the oil on his head. Why is there so much oil leak? I like how he's just running back and forth between the windows like he's doing something inter like helpful. Man, you're just wasting your energy. I mean, I guess ultimately sometimes it's more convenient, sometimes it's not. Did you get uh, an idea of what's different about game mode B or not? So far, I can't really tell other than a guess of it's maybe more difficult. Risky, he was over there for a while. Keep 
do this kind of shit. So it's interesting because it seems like optimally you would always just go one for one and just not or have a uh, less chance of failure. But well, no, optimally is you do it quick and not fail. Seems like the safest thing to do would be that. But I just want to get those points, man. Plus, there's always that interesting question of. Is going faster actually tech? No! Oh, me and my stupid. I thought I went too far that time, but I didn't. We are halfway there. Squidward is on the chair. Okay. Alright, almost at 200. We didn't find the difference, huh? What did it? Probably just more difficult. That, however, they determine that. That's more oil dropping and moving more. Radically down there. That doesn't seem fast enough. I'd be concerned. It's kind of funny how much it actually makes sense. No! This is bad. So now I have two fails. It's kind of funny how much, uh... It makes sense that you feel that you hit when you hit the bucket three times in Smash Bros. Because that's like exactly what's going on here. You see the clear three buckets. That's the moment where you have to dump. A lot of things I feel like actually really make sense in the when you uh see what games they come from. Like, the fact that when he goes into his juggle mode... I really want to make it! I'm so close! They turn into their stock icon because it looks really similar to the ball that you juggle. That was, like, the first time it seemed like dunking at three was just not the answer. No! I saw that coming, but I, like, didn't have a choice. Maybe... Once I start getting to the end, I need to start dunking it too. Bummer. Well. There goes my doing it all in one shot. Oh wait, I technically failed the first fast in. Back down to zero. The only let's see. I don't think I I didn't do Snoopy in one go. I failed at the beginning. Actually, I think I failed at the beginning of Fire Attack. That's a, that's kind of a demo. Ah, you all got oil on, you suckers. Hmm? Get away. All over your nice new suit. I just had this dry clean. So if on a full three, get eight total. Is it really five points for dunking the three? That's so much more than dunking at two. Oh, that's oh, no, that was five. Yeah, because two was just two. What's well, a lot more? It's just a lot more scary. Oh man, just based off of the sounds. How do you know if it's on the right? Oh, do each of the different, the middle, left, and right all have a different sound? 
didn't notice that. Yeah, the guy on the bottom would be the hardest part, knowing what side he's at, because I don't think he makes a noise at all when he switches, does he? And that would just be so hard to keep track of perfectly. There are people who beat games blindfolded. Just, just wild. Why is the gas station so, like, small? That's what I want to know. Facilitated game where you have to dump away a lot of buckets, that's why. I wonder how, like, determined the rate at which the oil drops out of the pipes is. Am I going to get stuck in similar nasty situations late unless I dump early? Timing always the same. All right, made it to 100. I think I'm doing better than the last time. I failed at like 50 or something. Actually, didn't I have a failure on top and bottom by 100? Or was that by 100? Oh. I still had some wiggle room. like this one. It's maybe that was the moment where I should have dumped sooner. Find that time. This one's Okay, 150. Lost one at the top. It's just hard to know if you're going to be safe, because you have to make the decision to dump the two before you even get to the... Like, I'm going to dump... Like, if he lines up when I get two, or if he's on in when I get two, that's fine. Two more. Right at the same time again. About right at the same time. Right right now, we seem perfect, I think. Maybe we've lost it a little bit. A little early. Oh, this is the, that was the time not to do it. When he leaves, like right when you're about to catch the second one, that's when you. Well, no, well, and much a choice of that. Yeah, that would have been. Would have been waiting. Yeah, that would have been bad. Uh oh, it's bad again though. It's like it's actually pretty close, so we're only getting slightly off sync. So everything's a lot worse right now. I'm going to start doing twos. If I do one two, does that put me back on sync or not? Hold there. One, one. Uh, he kind of left on two. Ah, oh, dang it. Oh, well. My first at the bottom. Okay, I think things are starting to get... Oh, I should have made that decision sooner. Okay, I'm gonna start doing twos. Getting scary. Maybe even ones. I'll do whatever makes the most. Uh oh, it just seems impossible. Oh.
Because the problem is they're so similar to being in sync that doing it at two is almost as bad as doing it as three. Doing it at three. That was risky. Gotta remember to... If I'm gonna be risky anywhere, I need to pour oil at the top. That's it. Oh, I missed it. Oh, no! Oh, okay, we're still good. I only filled at the top. I only filled at the top. I just need to catch two and I'm good. It scared me. Oh, I made it. Whew, that was actually the guaranteed way to make it. So make sure I didn't pour any at the bottom. Just let one fall to get the last two. <laughs> I did the I did the unintentionally optimal strats. The guaranteed no way of failing. This was definitely harder than game mode A. I'm not sure totally what's different, but maybe just the rate of their movements even being slightly at a different synchronization makes it harder. That's all it takes. I seem to find myself in more, like, really bad situations this time, or with this mode. But I'm just gonna be bold from here on out and always do three. Yeah, that was bad. I was stuck, though. Like, the whole time the oil was dripping, he was transitioning from the left to the right. And my third grab was on the right, so I didn't have time to dunk it if I wanted to. Darn it! <laughs> I moved out of the way. Slipping back to my old habits. Did it say when you get the second life, if at all? Like 600? 500? 700? There is no second life. Right. Oh, I like, didn't realize I had a full bucket. Oh, this is a bad one. Yes. Move it slow enough right now that it's not a problem. Does this one actually have the whole thing of lower 100 that's slower and it's faster as it goes up? I think mean, it didn't seem as obvious to me, but that kind of fell again at the rate the oil went down. Maybe that's how they get off sync later on. The guy at the bottom is always the same, but the oil speeds up as you go. What would also be kind of interesting is playing this, communicating with someone else, where one person can only see the bottom and one person can only see the top. So that the guy at the bottom has to be like, left, right. <laughs> I guess that would get old pretty fast, but... What'd be interesting is if you could actually co-op this, so you have the guy at the bottom always trying to move at the side that's more convenient for the guy at the top. I guess that would that'd get old. But it's also Game & Watch. It wouldn't be the first time they got old fast. Ah! Why did you dunk? Oh, I should've just poured it out. Well, Because I had all my fails at the top. That is game complete. Game & Watch Oil Panic is done.